Today on our 2003 Chevrolet Silverado 1500, we're going to be installing the Hopkins 7 and 4 pole trailer connector for the vehicle end, part number HM40975. Now here's what our 4 and 7 way plug looks like, as well as the bracket that comes with the kit. So to install the plug in the bracket, you would just simply slide it in, it would snap into position. Now we're going to need to choose a location here on the underside of the bumper to mount our bracket. Now this hitch is one of the heavy duty hitches, so we will need to trim just a little bit of this plastic cover here in order to mount our bracket and allow the wiring to come through and plug into the back side. We'll go ahead and pull our wiring down and then we'll do a test fit to see how much we're going to need to trim out. Now as you can see here, we're going to need to trim just a little bit of this plastic portion to allow the bracket to sit up flush against the bottom of the metal part of the bumper. We're going to go ahead and do a quick little paint mark here. So we'll need to trim this small area out right here for the bracket to sit up against the bumper. Go ahead and take a razor knife here and trim out the section of plastic. Now we'll go ahead and take a paint marker and mark our two holes. Now we'll go ahead and undo the wiring harness to do that. Push in on this little locking tab here and gently pull out. Set that aside for right now. We'll go ahead and drill our two holes right there. We'll go ahead and use the self-tapping screws that come with the kit. Now we'll need to pull the plug back out of the bracket so we'll simply squeeze metal tabs here and it'll slide back out. Go ahead and set our plug aside for now and then go ahead and attach our bracket. We'll go ahead and take our wiring harness and we'll pull it through the bracket. Now before we connect our wiring harness to the back of the plug, we're going to install a little bit of dielectric grease, which is part number 11755. We'll then go ahead and take the factory wiring harness and plug it onto the back side of our new plug, making sure that the locking tab clicks into position. Now we'll go ahead and work the wiring back through the bracket, where we'll snap it back into place. I will go ahead and take a zip tie to help secure any loose wiring up underneath the vehicle. Go ahead and trim off any excess zip tie. And that'll do it for the installation of the Hopkins 7 and 4 pole trailer connector for the vehicle end. Part number HM40975 on our 2003 Chevrolet Silverado 1500.